guys, so welcome back to my channel. I'm super excited to do this video because it's three super quick, fast, easy looks that you can do that are perfect for back to school, especially if you wake up late or you don't want to put a lot of effort and time into it, but you still want to look put together for school. These are what you need. The first look is more of a neutral look with some sparkle in it. The second one is a neutral eye with a pop of color. And the third one is this look right here with the winged liner and the bold lip. I also show you three different colored bold lips that you can use that work perfect with this eye, which they make it look so put together, but in really, when really it took me no time at all to do this. So if you want to learn what they are, just keep watching. All right, so I already have my foundation, concealer, blush, and bronzer and stuff all done. If you guys want to see a foundation routine, just let me know in the comments below and I can show you how I do my foundation and stuff every day. Um, so I'm just going to start by priming my eyes with um, the Too Faced Shadow Insurance. This one is in Champagne. It has like a really nice shine to it. And honestly, you could wear this by itself with some mascara and go. That'd be really quick too. But um, I'm going to show you how to do it with some shadows. So now I'm just taking the L'Oreal Infallible eyeshadows, which are more like pressed pigments. But this one's in Amber Rush. And I'm just using my clean fingers. I washed my hands. And I'm putting it all over my lid. And I'm kind of doing it in layers where I put some on and then grab some more and pack it on. Because that I just want to get the most pigment I can. And then I'm going to put it a little bit underneath my lower lash line there too. And I'm using my fingers instead of a brush because I want to get really good pigment. Plus, it's really fast. And now I'm just taking another L'Oreal Infallible. And this one's in the color Ice Latte. And I'm using it to highlight. But I'm also bringing it down a little bit to blend it into the amber, excuse me, amber rush, which is in my crease. And I'm also, I know I kind of cut it off there, but I'm also putting it in my tear duct and then on the center of my lid. And honestly, guys, that's it. It's so quick, so fast, so easy, and then I'm just putting mascara. And I put about, like, two or three coats, but honestly, it looks so good. And it looks like you put time and effort into it, but it literally took, like, a minute. <laughs> and now I'm just pairing it with um, a NYX Butter Gloss in Creme Brulee. It's really, like, a nude, shiny lip gloss. So now for the second look, I'm using my Bare Minerals 5-in-1 BB Advanced Performance Cream Eyeshadow or something like that. I mentioned it in my July Favorites if you guys haven't seen that yet. Basically, I'm using that as an eye primer too because it doesn't crease at all. And I'm putting it all over my lid and kind of blending it up into my crease. Again, using my fingers because it just makes everything so much faster when you don't have to worry about a ton of different brushes. And now I'm just taking a Lancome Champagne color from a quad, and I'm putting it all over my lid and underneath my eyebrow. It's the same color, but when you put it on top of the cream shadow and then on top of just your skin with no cream shadow, it makes it look like two different colors when it's really just the same color. And now I know I'm so sorry I cut this off again, but I'm just taking a matte brown from that same eyeshadow quad, and I'm blending it into my crease. That's all I'm doing with a big fluffy brush. Just blending away. And now I'm taking the fun part, which is a shimmery eyeliner by Nika K New York, I believe is how you say it. And it's just a blue shimmery eyeliner. And I just did a little bit of a wing. This, guys, is what makes the look. You can do any color eyeliner. You can even do, like, a wet eyeshadow and use it as a liner, and you get your pop of color. I just think it looks really funky and, like, you put time into it when it really was really quick and easy. And then I show you two different lip colors. This one's Naked by Urban Decay. And then the next one is a drugstore one, which is one of the Whispers. I forget what color it is, but I'll list it down in the description box. And then I started singing. <laughs> Come on, Marquesa, move on. Alright, for the third look, I'm taking my concealer, which is the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. And I'm putting it on my eyelid, and I'm going to use this as my primer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to blend it out, and then I'm going to pat it into my eyelid. I'm going to pat it so that I have a less chance of creasing. 
yeah, by pressing it into the skin, it'll help, like, blend it out a lot better so you have less creasing. And I love this because it kind of cancels out any discoloration. And now I'm setting it with um, just my face powder and this fluffy brush from Sigma. Just setting it. I just, I don't want it to move. I don't want it to crease and I want it, my eyeshadows to blend really nice on top of it. So now what I'm going to do is, actually instead of taking an eyeshadow, I'm going to take my bronzer, which is the Too Faced Chocolate Bronzer. And I'm using that um, basically just as my crease color. And because I'm going to do a winged look, I'm going to kind of wing out my shadow too. And I'm just going to blend this in really good. Using bronzers just make it super quick and super easy, making them have like a dual purpose. And I'm also taking a small pencil brush by Sigma, and I'm just blending some of that bronzer underneath my lash line. And then also just adding a little bit more to my crease just to kind of define it a little better. Now it's time for the liner. Now I'm using a gel, black gel liner and a Sigma E05 brush, I believe. It's just a really tiny little brush. And I'm gonna do a wing. Not really a big wing or like anything exaggerated, just kind of a little one, just to kind of get the look. I don't want anything too fancy. This will be more of like an everyday winged liner. And I'm not gonna show my whole liner here. If you guys wanna see a tutorial on how I do my winged liner, just also leave me in the comments, let me know. So that's it. Now I'm just gonna add some mascara. Honestly, all three looks are just so quick and so simple, and they take barely any effort. When I'm doing my mascara here, I'm also just going to concentrate it on the outer edge more, so it kind of goes along with the wing. And I put a little bit on the bottom lashes, too. <laughs> I'm checking to make sure my wings are even. <laughs> and now for the lips. All right, and that's all I have for you guys today. I hope you like it and learned something new. If you did, make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I post videos like all the time, and I don't have anything else, so I hope you guys have a great day. Bye! Pop bold lip, pop of color in the lip. Liner with color in it. And if you did like my channel, Mm-hmm. Good, good, good.